Not today! <laughs> what are you doing? Well, I gotta get the carbs off of that. Gotta do this and gotta do that. You just need to lay it on its back. You know what I mean? That's what he said. See, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Go, boy. <laughs> <laughs> Swing this all the way around. Here, hang on. Did I do the dosey do? Yeah. Well, I don't want to do the dosey do. Whoa, easy there, Cletus. What are you doing? I told you I, sw I got to swing this around. So you have to pull that forward a little bit. Oh, yeah, that's easier said than done. Man, I'm getting greasy again. You're. Well, you gotta stay greasy, dude. No. No. You got problems there. Yeah. Well, shit. Just put a Easy. hand. Easy. Just put a hand on it. I'm gonna get this person to lay a hand on it. Yeah, I need to have a hand lay on it. You know what? You're dangerous. Ow! What are you doing? What are you doing? Why don't you put, a, put that stitching cord up? Why'd you do this? Why'd you do that? Well, I'm just saying. Hey, mailman's here. I wish I'd get my uh, call tag keeper that I ordered. Huh? I'm supposed to come up. Huh? Who's bringing it? Uh, United States Postal Service. When's it supposed to be here? Uh, when it when they put it in the mailbox, comes on the counts. Yeah, dude, what are you doing? Here, jack that up for me. No, no. no. I'll make her something useful. No, this is ridiculous. Make a man do this. You know, it's okay. No, it ain't. Maybe, maybe for you. This is a bunch of boo craps, what this is. You know you know what boo crap is, don't you? When somebody scares you, you crap your drawers. That's boo crap. You know it? Bunch of boo crap. Boo crap. Yeah. See, they, they went boo, and then you crack. <laughs> Come on, Cletus! <laughs> Dang, I was getting a little violent there, wasn't I? You're doing that. Huh? You're doing it. No. I don't want it to swing violently and take out the champion 202 over here. You know, that would not be good. No, it wouldn't be good. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? His dad would say, what's your problem? What's what wrong your... with you? What's wrong with you? No, he'd go, you? what's wrong with you? What's your problem? <laughs> there you go, Jeffrey. Now I keep jacking it. That's you gotta get it up to here. That's twenty dollars. Twenty 
Forty dollars over ten minutes. Uh, yeah. This ain't Halliburton. Halliburton. Yeah. This ain't Cheney Land. <laughs> nah, this ain't no Cheney bullshit, right? <laughs> Easy. Where are you going to? To China. China? China? China, Chucky. Going to China? China. Ch -ch 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 China. Ch -ch -ch China. Ch -ch 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 China. Everything's made in China. No wonder everything's falling apart. All right, I got to get my fuel pump so I can put this gas in the boat. Hey, guys, check it out. I made a makeshift little fuel siphoner. Hot wire, ground wire, hook it up to a battery, and you can siphon fuel all day long. Isn't that cool? I need to get a paddle bit to drill a hole up here so I can hang it up. You don't need a beer pong. You can do just... Here, I, I need to fill right. you up with some ethanol free. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So what, you just start that and you're going to leave now? Well. What? Why? Why not? Because. Well, this uh, lower unit ended up being a real fun time. Anyway, I finally got it shifting, and let me tell you what I did completely by accident, and I don't know. So that shift plunger and shift cam, there's a shift cam, right? The shift cam, I put this in what would be forward gear. So that means it would be rotating counterclockwise. And then installed the uh, prop shaft. And then what I did was you'll have to, when you put the bearing carrier in, what worked for me anyway, was that you put it in, but you got to kind of push in while you put the retaining nut. And I got that as tight as I could and then you know later on I ended up torquing it down but then I put the motor in forward gear and it went up on the motor now my, I'll tell you I thought that what I would do was just put it in forward gear because we couldn't get it I talked to the customer it wasn't working out I figured something was damaged it in the lower unit other than anyway so I thought well at least he could be in forward gear if he needed to use it he could but put it on there put it in forward gear I attached the cables and then I thought well let's see what happens we'll put it back into reverse and I was shocked to find that that thing went into reverse and then I was like okay so then I put it into reverse, and sure enough, it's in reverse. So I can't tell you what I did, what I didn't do. I can tell you what worked for me was uh, having the load of that cam, that shift cam, when it's in counterclockwise like I showed in some other videos. I showed the, the shift cam and the position that, because so, I would redo this video, but... Uh, anyway, I have that picture of it in, on the previous video, and so that shift cam uh, that turns and rotates, uh, you put it in forward gear, and then you put the prop shaft in, and you can push against it, and you can feel the spring springing, you know. So, but when you put the bearing carrier in, you're gonna have to push in on it because it's tending to try to put pressure back and you know push it back towards the retaining that 
So anyway, push in while you get the retaining nut started and then just try to tighten it down as far as you can. And uh, anyway, you're doing this all in four gear. It's kind of weird. It's different than I would think, but this is what somehow it worked for me. And uh, so then once I got that shift in, then I took my tool and uh, torqued that thing down to, I don't know, it was like 140 foot-pounds, something like that. And I shifted. Now, I told him to go run it, see how it did. And, you know, bring it back to me if, uh, if it's something that, like, we need to adjust. Wow, what a deal this one was. Didn't expect that. Anyway, thanks for watching, subscribing, and commenting, and uh, I guess learned a few things on this one. Um, never had one like this, but... I'm glad that one is over and done with, so we'll see you next time.